how to mitigate problems like algorithm bias bias in artificial intelligence this is a very good question so we believe that artificial intelligence is a god like phenomenon which knows everything etc well that is not true artificial intelligence is essentially something that emerges mostly well there are a number of ways to emer- to to construct or create artificial intelligence one of the ways is machine learning in which you have in which you have an algorithm which is fed data it and it uh, learns on its own based on pattern recognition etc and that is how it develops its, its own so called intelligence it learns on its own it is sometimes supervised learning sometimes it's unsupervised learning etc but you you find that these algorithms they learn on their own for example you have these chess playing algorithms that basically learn how to play chess by playing lots of chess games against themselves or by, or by going to a great amount of data of hundreds of thousands of chess gla- games that were played in the past so it learns on its own the rules of chess and then it can start defeating human players now you have these other algorithms like language recognition algorithms automatic translation algorithms and text generator algorithms which are able to generate text based upon certain keywords that you input and it gives you very human readable text it looks like it's been written by human beings so this is basically the thing we are talking about and this is where algorithm bias comes in so algorithm bias is it occurs in a variety of ways first of all uh you may have a faulty algorithm an algorithm that produces results that are systematically biased or prejudiced because of erroneous assumptions in the machine learning process which could arise from faulty or poor or inaccurate data yeah because if garbage goes in garbage comes out you know this is the old adage in computer science gigo garbage in gar- garbage out so if you have data that is inaccurate it is poor it is biased in some manner it is not representative of the entire population etc for example that's what happens or you can have pr- problems introduced by people who design and train the machine learning system who create algorithms that reflect either unintended cognitive biases of theirs or actually real life prejudices right for example i have seen this myself you have this gpt3 uh text generation uh artificial intelligence basically and if you input keywords related to india into it it outputs text that looks like it has been written by marxists hindu phobic text that reflect certain kinds of biases against india so it is because these people who have been training the algorithm when it comes to india related subject matter they have been basically feeding it texts that have been written by leftist and marxist academics and left oriented uh journalistic publications it's very clear so whenever you input something related to india keywords related to india into gpt3 it gives you it outputs you paragraphs of text that look like they have been written by some professor in jnu jawaharlal nehru university so that is a clear demonstration of algorithm bias so either these biases are created by poor data or data that is prejudiced or it is slanted in a certain ideological or cultural direction it either uh, reflects real life prejudices of certain people of the people who are introducing the data or unintended cognitive biases or biases that are introduced by incomplete or faulty or prejudicial or biased data sets to train and validate these machine learning systems so that is algorithm bias so so you have to address the real reason why this bias has occurred either it is a, a faulty algorithm or it is data that is not representative of the entirety of knowledge about that particular thing for example in the case of india if you feed only data that comes from left leaning journalistic organizations or leftist marxist professors then the machine learning algorithm will get trained on that and every time you give it keywords related to india it's going to give you output that looks like it's been produced by jnu professors so that is what algorithm bias is so the mitigation is it depends on how it has been introduced